Hey guys, I'm back, and today I'm going to be telling you another scary story, as you can probably tell by the thumbnail and all that stuff. And today's spooky story is, dun da 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 drip, drip. This is actually the first of two versions of this that I know, and today I'm going to be telling you the shorter one. Let's get into it. One dark, still night, a boyfriend and a girlfriend were driving home from a date at the theater when they heard on the radio that a psycho had escaped the nearby asylum and everyone should lock their doors and not answer for anyone. This scared them because they were coming to a very long stretch of dark highway that they needed to go on to get home. A few minutes passed. Then they started seeing smoke coming out of the front of their car. And the car started wobbling. So the boyfriend pulled over under a patch of trees on the side of the road. Then the boyfriend handed the girlfriend a crowbar and told her to get down on the floor of the back seat and to not answer or move under any circumstances. Whatever you do, don't move. Just lay down and stay quiet. She lied down on the back seat, and the boyfriend got out of the car to check what was wrong and try to fix the car. A few more minutes passed, and the girlfriend started started to hear dripping on the back of the car. Drip, drip, drip. She waited for it to stop, but it wasn't stopping. Drip, drip, drip. Against her boyfriend's orders she got up to look out the back window to see what was dripping and she saw her boyfriend hanging upside down from the tree branch above them his blood dripping on the trunk of the car the end (laughs) please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell and if you liked the video just hit the thumbs up or if you disliked it hit the thumbs down it doesn't matter Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!